What's going on guys? Today we'll be hunting for a restock. And if we find anything good, it doesn't matter because I don't need to leave anything for the kids. I don't need to leave anything for, for anyone else. I need to buy everything. So let's go see what we can find. Just look at this insane restock, literally filled to the brim with every type of milk you can imagine. I think 2% is reselling for the most value, so I'm gonna pick up a few of these 2% jugs. Whoever displayed these eggs really went above and beyond. What I'm probably gonna do with these is crack these bad boys open so I can stock my egg whites and my yolks separately for maximum profit. Is this legal? Okay, somehow I'm involved in the assembly line here. I'll probably pick up a pallet of these 12 extra large eggs to stock my store, and this is probably Probably gonna make me a lot of money. All right, check this out. Jello four packs were a no brainer. They were on sale, so obviously they have super easy turnover. Move over vanilla, chocolate, you're gonna be coming with me. You can never go wrong picking up some Arizona iced teas. Even though this looks like a fresh restock, you always wanna check under the shelf for hidden items like this. Down below here, we have some half and half Arnold Palmer, literally the best flavor. So we're gonna pick these up. All right, check this out. Here's something you wanna look out for. The chicken is almost completely sold out, but everyone knows steak is king. Because liver is king. This is a really deceptive thing, and they probably haven't stocked this in months, so I'm actually just gonna leave this behind. Bro, the cat food section was stocked, and the colors really helped me choose the items I wanted because I don't know how to read. The green looked really good, but I decided to go with the other one because I'm just trying to make a profit out here, and honestly, it doesn't matter what I'm buying. I'm gonna upcharge whatever I sell anyway. Finally, I'm gonna pick up these mystery boxes here. The Pokemon community loves mystery boxes. I wasn't really sure which one I wanted to pick up. Strawberry looked pretty lame. We already have the chocolate pudding. So I'm gonna go ahead and get one of these small mystery boxes. It looks like they have some Astral Radiance here, but honestly, this is a pretty trash set. So I'm probably gonna leave this behind. Let's go back to the studio and go over what we got. We're gonna start out with our mystery box here. Um, if this is anything like a Pokerev pack, then we should be looking for gold tier uh, mystery inserts. Uh, so let's go ahead and open it and and let's find out what we get. I'm uh, I've heard really good things about this, so I'm really excited to open this one. To start out with, seems like our mystery insert is gonna be first. Ooh, and we pull a silver tier. So these are supposed to have um, I think black and white packs in it, which is super super cool. Great value for these mystery boxes. Just picking up one randomly. Let's go ahead and open this up and see if we can pull something nice. Go ahead and turn it over. You can see we have some some damage here. Definitely not a PSA 10. Um, honestly, quality control on this is terrible. Oh my god, no way. Of all the cards to get it, more damage on the card. That was that's upsetting. Let's go ahead and see what's inside s'mores just like we knew it would be let's see if the cat food we bought is good it seems like annie can't wait to get into this one just look how cute she is let's try and get a different angle here of her eating and it seems like we picked the right flavor just look at her go let's move on next up we got trash set of the century which is astral radiance which we're just gonna rip right through this get over it as quickly as possible so we can move on oh look at that dropped a few cards but like i said it doesn't really matter worthless and all we get is a regular v all right i'm done 